everybody welcome back to let's talk this is me meera and today i'm going to clear out a confusion now this confusion is related to chances when i say chances i mean that there are times when people invite you for a party or you get a message that are you going to be visiting us or your facebook invitations your instagram invitations and you get confused as to what to say what do i reply am i going i am not going i'm probably going maybe i'm going but i don't know what it means does that happen to you yes and i've often seen people getting confused with the message i remember this time when i told my mother that i'm probably coming home late right and when i went home she yelled at me and said you said you are probably getting late you never said that you are going to get so late super late so i said mom probably means there is a ch- high chance of me getting late well guys don't worry just like my mother if you are confused don't worry that night i cleared her confusion today i will clear out your confusion are you ready let's get started guys so we have four columns over here let's get quick revision of what are the words in these columns probably possibly maybe or perhaps now let me tell you one thing very clearly you would not use these these words for anything that is factual anything that is realistically factual and proven for example we are probably living on earth what we are living on earth of course unless and until you are a comedian or you want to pass a sarcastic comment or a funny comment you can but otherwise you cannot now let's see what all of these mean and how they are different from one another probably means that there are more than half that means more than 50% of chances high chances of something happening okay i am probably dieting that means i'm more than 50% sure that i will diet okay possibly second word for the day less than 50% chances half chances of something happening i'm possibly on a diet i'm not sure yet that means there is very less chance that i'm going to diet i will definitely eat a pizza today well maybe means that there is a 50 50% chance i may be dieting i may not be dieting who knows right 50 50% chance and perhaps is nothing but a formal way of saying maybe and a very fancy way and a very if i may say so a very english or a british way of saying maybe okay now are you clear with the first confusion quick revision high chances of something happening is probably 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 remember possibly means less than less than half less than 50% of chances of anything happening that's possibly maybe mm, eh, mm, who knows 50 50 and perhaps is a formal maybe now that i've cleared that doubt let's get to sentences and examples all right guys now this is a sentence my question could have been would you like to visit us this summer and the answer is probably i would visit what does that tell you does that tell you that there are high chances of me visiting or there are less chances probably means there are high chances that i would visit which is a great news that means i would definitely visit high chances of high chances all right of me visiting now let's say i have asked i've asked i've, I've i'm at the i'm at this airport right and i am asking an attendant or a manager sir is there a possibility of me changing the flight and the attendant or the manager says possibly not mm, 
I don't think so. What is he trying to say? He's trying to say that there are less chances of that happening. But I insist, I push him and I say, could you please try? I'm in an emergency. I need to change my flight ASAP. Is there anything I can do to change my flight? And he says, there is a possibility if you pay more, okay? There is a possibility if you pay more. That means if I'm going to pay extra money, am I going to get the tickets changed, my flights changed? Yes. And that is exactly what he's trying to say. If When I asked him in the first, uh, first question, he said, possibly not because that's not happening. But when I told him that I will do anything, then he said, if you pay more money, you might be able to change your flight tickets. Now, maybe, let me ask you a question. Do you think she will win this competition? Do you think India will win Miss World this time? And you say, maybe she will win. That means there is a 50% chance that she may win or there is a 50% chance that she may not win, right? Well, that is maybe. A chance that you're just not taking a risk to answer, okay? Would you like to come for a party? Maybe. Maybe I will. Maybe I won't. Don't take my word for it. I will tell you later. That's what you mean. Now, perhaps, if I'm asking you the same question, do you think she will win? And you can replace maybe with the word perhaps and say perhaps she will win. It's the same as maybe. Moving on to the last point of the day and for the lesson, you guys. Look at this sentence. There is an addition and try to guess what that is. Now, um, I get a phone call and the customer service executive asks me, is this a good time to talk or is this a good time to call? And, the, and I reply to that, probably a bad time to call. That means that was not a good time for her to call me. But I want you to focus on the addition, which is the word earlier. Now, guys, whenever we talk about these words, probably, possibly, maybe, and perhaps, in terms of probably, you can use wor the word a, uh, the article a uh, and or the in the sentences whenever you can, whenever you're using the word probably. A bad time, a bad time to call. Probably a bad time to call. So here I have used a. Uh. Let's see what I've used in the next sentence. Possibly, is this, do you like this phone that you have bought? Maybe you have bought a new phone, right? And I'm replying or I'm giving my advice or suggestion or feedback to a friend. And I say, possibly the worst phone I have ever used. Here, I have again used the article, the. Here as well, I can use a, an, or the after these words, after the word possibly. Okay, a bad time, a bad, the worst phone. Okay, now maybe, maybe, let's see what this sentence means. Now I have said that, oh my God, She's in a terrible mood since morning. What can I do to help? Maybe an ice cream would help. Here I have used the article an. Maybe an ice cream would help. Perhaps not a good time. The sentence is in a negative state, which is where I've used the word not, but we're talking about articles and I have used uh, over here. Perhaps not a good time to talk. I will talk to you later. Points to remember, you can use words like articles, a uh, and the whenever you're using any of these four words, okay? You can also make negative sentences, but I will make sure that I take a different lesson for it as I don't want you guys to get confused about it. I hope the confusion is 
now clear where probably high chances possibly less chances maybe 50 50% chances and perhaps is the formal version of maybe all right guys that was the lesson for today i hope you have learned something make sure you practice these words and use these words okay i will be back very soon with another interest interesting lesson until then keep smiling keep practicing spread a lot of love you guys this is me meera signing off for the day bye